Well, good afternoon, everybody. Welcome to another radio video. Today, we're going to do an antenna project because uh, we're never satisfied completely with the antennas that we have, and it's fun to try something new. So I'm going to do a <clears throat> build an antenna for uh, AM, uh, AM broadcast band, and um, this is uh, about as cheap uh, as you can get and about as easy as you can get. So really all you need are some, uh, some wire. Here's just some insulated wire, both of these. Uh, just some junk wire that I had laying around. Um, this one has an alligator clip on, which can be useful. I've got a piece of copper uh, pipe or copper tubing that I'm going to use for a ground rod. This isn't very long, but we're going to try to make that work. And I got some tape. So, um, sometimes you get homebrew project ideas and it seems easy enough, but there's one component that just is not readily available or you don't have it on hand. This is a, a super cheap, super easy build, and uh, I think it's, it's pretty effective, or at least we're going to see how effective it is. And uh, that's all it takes. So I'm going to show you what I come up with, and you can make it yourself. Okay, here we have the uh, antenna installation. Got a wire which is just hung uh, onto the back, the uh, arm of the trampoline. And it's just coming over here to my patio umbrella. And here's a coil. Move the radio aside. Here's a coil of wire. It's about a four inch uh, circle with about seven turns of the wire just taped together. Very simply. And then the end of the antenna goes to this grounding rod here in the ground. Okay. So once again, this is about as as cheap and inexpensive as it gets. So let's see how it works. All right, here we are with the uh, Sony SW10. Just gonna tune down the medium wave band. Oh, we got it. And you can see there's just not a whole lot happening. Kind of weak. Not a whole lot coming in. There's a couple strong local uh, New York City stations. Just pretty much the powerhouses. So let's uh, let's put the uh, loop here. And Out the antenna. Usually experiment and find the sweet spot. I found in this radio, it's right there in the corner. That's a local. Let's turn it up a little bit. So you can see this radio, it's a, it's a nice little nice little radio, but it just doesn't pick up these fringe stations. In Central Park, the time is... That's a local. This is the voice WEU, Reading and WEU.com. Station in Reading, that's about 100 miles away. Most political parties have said there's no evidence suggesting that it's true, but for a second day, Donald Trump and... So you can see this this antenna is really quite effective. 
residence of the Big 12 Conference. On the second floor of the Big White House. And it makes a station. That one isn't even... I thought maybe that one would be audible a little bit without the antenna. How old he is. And you get to be 30 and you look at someone else and say, look at that person. Yeah, I reviewed this. There were investigators. Look at the situation. Prosecuted. Yeah, that one. Well, yeah. Under Secretary Patrick Kennedy I mean, was that asked sounds like about local. the rationale. Was asking about the rationale used for changing a classification, but stopped short of. So there you have it. Oh, House Speaker Paul Ryan. A little piece of wire makes a uh, makes a huge difference. So there's an easy uh, antenna project. Doesn't take much time. Takes hardly any time. Can do for practically nothing. If you got some wire floating around, you make a really nice little AM antenna. And if you're savvy enough, you can fix it up so it's uh, a permanent installation inside your home. So that's about it for this. Uh, video. Hope you've enjoyed it. And uh, for more radio related videos, check out my channel. So for now, this is Tom 73.